If you ask an average youth, how sincere are you with God? Like Pastor said, you can only attract what you have. How sincere are you with God? The people that say they want to marry is not butter and bread. What time have they invested in prayer? Before now they said they settle it in their heart that marriage is not for them. You see that most of the thing they are doing is just uh, like we said, uh, tungbu tungbu, you know, brother A or brother B. So when they notice the potential in brother A, ah, I said it that this brother is not meant for me. Only for brother B to be protect, care, carefully covering his own. Then by the time they discover brother B, excuse me, everybody have issues. That's what they don't want to face. They want to marry an angel. A brother that will just, you know, you say sit down there and uh, yes, yes, my dear. Hallelujah. If Christianity is so easy and sweet, Christ will not tell you, carry your cross. They don't want to carry cross. Excuse me, like uh, our brother said, sometimes you wake up, even in marriage, and you say, ah, Father, who are did I offend? But after a while, you are still, everything has changed again. You say, you are the best thing that happened to me. It happens. But when you remember that, even when you say, who did I offend? You cannot step out. You'll be saying, God, give me grace. But this generation, they will tell you, if you don't change by tomorrow, you will you'll talk with my lawyer. You are going to talk with my lawyer. <laughs> God will help this generation, no? Oh.